Hi friends, today we are going to discuss about one very important topic. It's about how will I know which is the T code that I have to maintain my configuration table. So, so uh, in one of the video I have already discussed how you know the customizing table or the configuration table associated with the T code using ANST. But this one will tell you which T code is associated in order to maintain it. Okay. So imagine, uh, uh, so what I'm going to do is I'll create a ABAP query. Okay. Uh, very simple ABAP query and the ABAP query, I'll just give a name, create and oops, not this name, zgit t code uh, config. Okay. And this is the name I give click create okay get configuration config okay. and we'll make this less than three minutes okay and table join click yes that's good we'll just put two tables very easy T tstcp okay and and we'll put tstct okay one is the parameter table for transaction code. One is the table for the text. Okay. Now what I'm going to do, this one is very easy. I'll select all and I'll just click green arrow. Selection fields, I'll just select transaction code parameters, language. Okay. And that's it. Click save. Click execute. Time check. It's less than a minute. Okay. So now suppose I want to see anything that is related with uh, T024. Okay. I came to know. I don't really know what is the transaction code. <clears throat> so I'll just put P024, just mention star in between and we just execute. The moment we execute, we get all these things. Now here we gave the description also just for the heck, you know, you will be very helpful. And now suppose I want to see, I want to do purchasing group company code. Okay, I just want to make sure I just test one. Okay, so I'll go here, I'll just go into this place and I'll select slash n and I paste this on kg and this is the config place. Um, so this is one, let's let's try to do something else. Okay, so let's try to find something very, very popular, uh, T001W, okay. Here that's related with plant, everyone knows. And uh, if you didn't know, now you know. So suppose I want to see anything tables like OX10, right? So we go to OX10 now, slash and OX10, okay. Slash enter, okay, that's it, right, got it. Okay, so this is the way you can find it. Uh, let's, do you want to do another uh, another table? I don't know what, what, what table we can do. So let's see T0, mm -hmm. Can we can we just do T zero zero star? You know, uh, sky is the limit, right? So T zero zero star, and here you can find all these things. So you get the descriptions. You can maintain table posting period. Why not F dash sixty? Okay, I didn't know that. So you know slash n F dash sixty. Okay, and here I maintain the posting period. So this is the way to find it. Very easy. And it will work in both SAP ECC6 and S400. That's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning and have a great day.